Well, there's a lot of chatter about the possibility of Northern Lights here in Michigan, and that possibility is certainly there. They're called CMEs, which is a coronal mass ejection. That's basically the sun erupting, launching energy our way, and it causes the northern lights. The timing of that energy arrival for the next two nights looks like it'll be kind of dead in the middle of the night. 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. You can start by looking to the north, but they could be a little higher in the sky if we get a really strong possibility. Getting away from city lights and letting your eyes adjust is the best way to do that. So for tonight, if we see some clearing, notice that viewing line kind of goes right through the southern part of our state. But as we go throughout tomorrow night, better chances exist, and that line goes all the way down into maybe even Kentucky. So they will definitely be a little higher of a possibility for Thursday night into Friday rather than tonight. So what we're looking at here, this is how you measure the strength of the energy coming to cause the northern lights. And we need at least a six to see them here in Lansing. A seven would be a lot better. And the forecast for those, exciting news for everybody, especially if you really want to see them, Tonight up to a six and tomorrow night up to a seven. So we just got to dodge the cloud cover for that possibility to happen. But notice here with the timing there on the right hand corner of your screen, a little bit of clearing is possible, but a lot of cloud cover could still exist as well and it could come and go. So we'll see, but um, the chances are there. Not a great possibility. Notice as we head into tomorrow night with that KP of seven, little bit of clearing possible here and there, but there will be a lot of cloud cover. So good luck, head out there and check them out.